Hello again. In this video clip, we're going to look at how to fold the sail. In the first video, we showed you how to grip the sail properly. So, just to recap on that again, we're going to make sure the sail is the right way around. So, you should be able to read wind paddle from the front here. Okay. If I can read wind paddle, it's the wrong way around. We're then going to take our thumbs down grip with the hand, place it over the grommet here. Same on the other side here like this. Place the bottom of the sail against our shins to stop the sail from twisting from side to side. Okay. Now remember, we're going to flatten the batten. So we're going to use our fingers at the top here to push the top of the sail down and then bring our hands in together like this. So once again, we can see the tape at the top of the sail. So the batten is the right way round and we're ready for the fold. Okay. So, the catchphrase we're going to use here to help you remember how to do the fold is chin to win. Okay? So there's two methods to do the fold. The first one is we're going to leave our hands about a foot apart here like this. And you can see that we have a loop at the top of the sail here. And using our catchphrase chin to win, we're going to fold the top of the loop down and back up towards our chin. Okay? So the top of the loop is pushed down and then back up around towards your chin like this. You then have a loop on the left and a loop on the right and you fold the left loop down and then the right loop down and then grip the three loops together and even them out and you've got a perfectly folded sail. Okay? There won't be any twists in the batten because we made sure that when we, when we flattened the batten, it was the right way up. Okay, to release the sail again, grip it tightly with the right hand here. Take your left hand and grip the top loop, and then release your right hand. Make sure you've got plenty of room when you're doing that. Okay, so we're going to look at the second method of folding now. So, we're going to grip it again at the grommets, thumbs down, place it against the bottom of our shins, push the top of the sail down and bring our hands in. So now as you can see, we can see the tape again, so we flattened the batten correctly and it's the right way up so we can start the fold. Okay, so for the second method now, we still remember chin to win, but as we push the top of the sail down and back up towards our chin, I'm going to cross my left hand over underneath my right hand, like this. So as it comes down and back up towards my chin, my left hand crosses underneath my right hand and I keep tucking the top of the loop up towards my chin and pushing the loops down on top of each other like that. And tidy up the sail and grip the three loops. Okay? So that's the second way of folding the sail. It doesn't matter which one you use, it's just a personal preference which one you use. Okay? So we're going to release the sail again, grip it tightly with the right hand, left hand on the top loop, make sure you've got plenty of space, and let the sail go with the right hand. Okay, so just quickly to recap on those, I'm going to grip the sail here. Okay, so first method, chin to win, leave your hands about a foot apart all the way through the fold, top the loop down, back up towards your chin, left loop over, right loop over. That's the first method. Okay. Second method, as we do our chin to win, bringing the top of the loop down and up towards our chin, we just cross the left hand underneath the right hand like this. Okay. They both end up with the same result, a perfectly folded sail. Okay, so in the next video clip, I'm going to show you how to fold the cruiser set. So we'll see you then.